So here we have the main factors that affect your, the accuracy of your tangency constructions. The first one is the pencil grain you are using, whether it's the hard type or the soft type. We can also think of this as the faint, whether the lines that the pencils will produce will be faint or deep. Now the problem, the problem with using the soft types is type of pencil, um, the B grade or even HB, as close as HB, is that it will make a stain on the on your drawing sheet, which is very difficult to remove. So when you draw the rear arc you intended to draw by it, okay, and then you have an intersection, another arc intersecting. Finding the point of intersecting intersection can become difficult, especially the, the closer the, the arc you create is to your other arcs. So instead of maybe locating your compass point here, okay, instead of locating your compass point somewhere here, you can easily find yourself locating your compass point here, okay. So using the, the using the soft grid of pencils, it's more likely to introduce errors into your drawing than using the hard ones. So I will always advise that you use your you use your two H and above for your compass pencil. All right, so our next point is very closely related to what we have, the one we have just completed. Now, when you are drawing your arc, make sure when you um, locate your, your compass point on the drawing sheet, it is in a place that it cannot sh shift. So what you do, what I, I advise you do is that you part your drawing sheet. You put um, a card, or um, another sheet of paper under your drawing sheet, such that when you locate your compass point, it will not be shifting. Because every time your compass point shifts, it introduces errors in your, in your arcs. Now, another point very connected to uh, the compass point location is the fact that when your compass is not very tight, the radius as you move along, the radius you do, of the arc you draw will be changing with respect to that to the arc with respect to the compass point. So it's very very important to to have your compass not to be loose while you make your arc drawings. Okay. Lastly, the pencil length thickness is very important. In locating your um, tangency points. Now, when the, the the line you draw, because the pencil length thickness affects the kind of line you draw. Now, if the line you draw is, for instance, this thick, or if the arc you draw is, for instance, this thick, why isn't this working? Okay, so you have your two arcs meeting. Okay. Your point of tangency your point of tangency could be anywhere could be anywhere here because the, the point of intersection is so large such that it is difficult to find the exact location of where you should put your your compass point okay so instead of this instead of this, we we'll prefer to have our, our intersecting arcs, something more like this. Okay, so that it's more difficult to make an error when you are placing your compass point. If I, you see it, if, when the compass point falls out of the point of intersection. All right, so that's what we have for now, and very important points too following avoiding errors in tangential constructions.